So as we wrap up, when you reflect back on on your journey and 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 stuff, what are the th- what are the advice would you give for? I would say for up and coming producers who are trying to get into the, to the game today, um, from well, from your experience, from how you started off, you got the you got the connection with Jamaster J and and to where you are now. What would your advice be for up and coming producers? Just do it and be great at it and 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 never stop believing. I always say this, um, the if you're at a bus stop, right? Eventually the bus is gonna come, right? If it's a legitimate, if it's the bus stop, right? Yeah. The bus is gonna e- eventually come. And I say if you're doing what you need to do and you're where you need to be, the thing that you're waiting for will eventually show up. You just have to be prepared when it does. So, you know, learn the craft, study to be better, study from the greats and to continue to do what you do and compete with no one but yourself. You know, just be great and love it, because if you don't love it, don't do it. That's I mean, it. I mean, that advice actually transcends just music, uh, because mm-hmm. I think about um, I think about myself and what I'm doing and think about times when. I almost got distracted by looking at different other people who seem to have been a lot more successful focusing on the gossip side. And I'm thinking, oh, I need to change stuff. And I right. know that my spirit wasn't agreeing with that, but it was like, you know, but that seems to be getting the, the attention and, and and having to go back to what the mission is and, and just working with that. And, and, and it can be tough because if you see people stepping out and doing things that meet properly, you, you, you can... Forget your own calling and your mission yes. and, and, and stuff. Um, yeah. But then I think it's important we hear that your faith has stayed and hasn't wavered. No, well, I won't say hasn't wavered, but it's, you've been anchored and you've, you've taken precautions to make sure that you don't get uh, sidetracked from, yes. I would say, your mission. Uh, I'm sure, you know, you, 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 what, 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 you know, when did your mom realize my baby has really, Made it, made it changing the world with his music. Wait, what, what was it? Is it I'm dreaming or what was the? <laughs> nope. It was when I did a Shirley Caesar song. You kidding me? Way after Platinum Records, way after Drew Hill, way after Dreaming. The <laughs> moment she found out I worked with Pastor Shirley Caesar, I made it to the big times. <laughs> <laughs> She didn't care about nothing else. <laughs> oh, good. Did you get it? Did you get to sh- introduce her to see sh- like, some of these gospel artists like T.D. Jakes and Shirley? C- oh, yes, absolutely, absolutely, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's like most people saying that when on on today's their family see them on Soul Train, <laughs> they won't. Yes, exactly, it. exactly. I always end my interviews back to my guest that if you're stuck in an elevator, what would be <clears throat> your favorite movie? My favorite movie? Oh boy, as of late. No, no. So, favorite... so the idea is that you're on an elevator and you're so sort of stuck, and it's like it's gonna take us two, three hours. So you get to pick your favorite movie to kill time. Your favorite movie ever of ever that you'd like, yeah, this is my song, my movie, I'll play it, watch it. Oh, <clears throat> uh, the Godfather. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Because there's so many lessons you know and i've watched it a million times but every time i watch it i learn something else you know lessons on loyalty and it's so many you know besides the killing and all the other stuff <laughs> yeah, there, yeah, are yeah. Some, there are some principles you know you know in, in 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 the dialogue so it's one of my favorite movies okay and then what's your all-time favorite song oh shirley horn here's to life okay Not to i love her. that song Okay. You have to hear it. Listen, listen, you should do yourself a favor. Namdi and listen to Shirley Horn. Here's to life. Game changer. Okay. I'll, I'll, yes. I'll do that. Um, okay. <laughs> and, and, and finally, I, I always have to ask producers when I interview them, who would make your top five producers? In no particular oh. order, but just who would be your top five producers? Of course, Quincy. Of course, um, Babyface, 
Rodney. Is it Babyface himself or LA and Babyface? So because you have to, the two different LA and Babyface. Okay. I mean, <laughs> okay, you can't just have one because they're two different. Yeah, he I had mean, two... <laughs> Rodney and 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 Teddy. Okay, so you had Quincy, LA and Babyface, Rodney and Teddy. So he's got one more. Um, now Rogers. Ah. I love now. I just his approach. I just just it's, he's he's a it's a signature sound. Yeah, that with with his with his with his guitar. Okay. Yes, I love now. <laughs> wow. So Stanley, when are we going to expect the? I know the sing "God Is Good" is out now, but when are we expecting a vi full visuals for that, and then the rest of the stuff to drop so we can? Well, we're working on this. Um... We're having conversations in regards to a video, but we're mixing the second single that I told you with Aaron, Christopher, Eric Bellinger, and Jason Nelson uh, next week. So we, we're working on that. So probably another month, you'll have another single. But um, but visuals for The God is Good before that as well? Yes, 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 okay. yes. We're just, we just trying to work it out with Karen, uh, Clark, uh, and Kiara, and their record labels to see what we can do to make that happen. But there will be some type of visual for that, something. Would you guys go we'll maybe sure. take the, the stuff on, on the road, the album or the... Definitely want to do something. I'm in talks to doing something with Lincoln Center. Um, a night, um, once, the, once the, pro the project is completed, the complete project is done, we want to probably do something at Lincoln Center. Oh, so that could be the visuals for the album and, and that could there, be... There you go. There you go. Yeah. Yes. It'll be a okay. night at Lincoln Center. Okay, yes. that would be good. Something, something to look for for Christmas and stuff. Yes, we're going to make it work. Yeah. Well, Stanley, it's been great. Um, you know, really, really fascinated by by your story about your, <laughs> um, you know, your journey, but also the fact that you, how you stay committed to your faith throughout that. And in, in an industry that I know too well, is it's it, it it can eat you up if um, if you aren't faithful. And, and 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 steadfast so it's been inspirational and, and i definitely would look forward to hearing the full album and 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 being able to let people see and and know um if we um websites and and it, what's the for for timeless music group what's social uh, stanley stanley a brown um on instagram at stanley a brown and on timeless music at timeless music group okay Okay. On Instagram, social media platforms. Okay. Well, Stanley, it's been a pleasure. Um, I know it's been a little long, but I just appreciate the time and everything. Oh, it's been you. great hearing your story, and we should look out for a book as well. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> so we, we yes, find out 100%. what happened to your dad and stuff. Okay, you got it, man. All right. Take care. Thanks, okay, Stanley. I, I appreciate you. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Hey guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for being part of the Half Time Chat community. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Uh, but most importantly, why don't you consider being a member as a way of supporting the channel, but also getting a lot of videos ahead of time, a lot of behind the scenes stuff, and some exclusive content that doesn't get shared. But anyway, thanks for watching and thanks for being part of Half Time Chat. Ooh.